You hear Hello, a with oh. wine from the east. Shouldn't have restarted. Uh, a dodge. Ha ha. Oh, We've done it. Close. Hello and welcome back to Space Quest Four. Let's dive into Spar before we get run over. Okay, hello. You guys are cool with me, even though you're the ones that are actually low poly, right? You see the bar's floor. Great. I looked at the bar's floor, so that's what I saw. You see hello, two guys boys. singing. Yeah. There's the bar, just as you remember it. Yeah. It's really. See, I hate when it does this. This what looks I... like the bar in Space Quest One. It does. A whole lot. From your position in the bar, you can only see sky through the window. Yeah. This looks like the bar in yeah. space. Yeah. See, I hate when it does this, because I know things because I'm cheating, but I like it when the game tells me the things I'm supposed to know. Uh, you see a book of matches on the bar countertop. Yeah. I guess you'd see the little pixel. No, I was hoping it would give a hint, but yeah, I want those. Give me those. It's a thing I can have. You pick up the book of matches. Perfect. I wonder if I can speak. Hello, buddy. Hey, aren't you the guy who broke my slot machine? You owe me some money. Well, I, I shouldn't have talked. My hog pod double park. Hey, it's been swell talking to you. Yeah. Uh, right, okay. Gotta go. Thank you for the batches. Have a good life. Definitely. I guess I did explode the vending machine, or the uh, slot machine, after I won my winnings. You hear a high pitched whine from the oh, east. Oh, crud. A dodge? Aha! My ninja reflexes are no match for your oh, bike. Or no, are, are a match for your bike. Your bike is no match for my ninja reflexes is the way I should have said that. Okay, why are these two-seaters, I wonder? I guess two cops got out of it. Okay. Bring up the hand. So now... I've got some matches. I don't know why, but I do. I came here, had some fun... Good laughs, great memories. Uh, let's head back to Xenon, I guess. Now, what is... I have the code here. It is funny R... Question mark. Oh, I kind of remember this. Uh, capital, uh, maybe an A? I oh, know, it's like the Among Us figure. Uh, an S? S? Uh, weird. It's like a three that's been shot. Ah, uh, this one. Three that's been shot. Uh, and an A again. The powerful quad Take me away. Drives Rev to life. Time and space yes. bend under the fibrillations of the time rip transfluxers. This is Your good. Your and stomach reel with the hyperbolic hyperbole. Hope there are no medical and issues finally, that come from this. Finally, nothing much. Happens. What are you talking about? That's 100% a hundred percent the code. code. Try again. What are you saying? Did I do? Maybe I put the wrong thing. So we got one of these. One of these. One of these. Is there another S shape? No, that's the only S. Got one of those. We got this thing. We got another A. The powerful quad quark. Come on, you know you wanna. To life. Time you know and you space work. bend under the fibrillation. Maybe this is the wrong code. Rip transfluxers. Your if I have another code. Stomach reel with the hyperbolic hyperbole. Mm-hmm. And finally, finally. Ah, uh, it did the bad nothing music. Nothing much happens. That must not have been a valid code. Yeah, Try but... again. Where did I put the other? I thought I took a photo of the other code, but I don't seem to have it on here. I have what I thought was the code up. That I'd be able to use. Uh, well, this is a fine how do you do. What? Okay. So. Inulance Flats. 
I leave the bar. Biker tries to run me over. Click away. Walk to the north. Another biker. Enter the time pod. Punch in the coordinates for Xenon. Which I thought were these. Um. Hmm. I could type in some random ones. Let's the go. Quad quark drives Rev to life. Time and space yeah. bend under the fibrillations of the time rip transfluxers. Uh -huh. Your adrenaline and stomach reel with the hyperbolic hyperbole. Yeah. And finally, finally, nothing much no. happens. That must not have been a valid code. Try <laughs> again. Must not have been. Good thing these things are uh, generous and don't explode after a couple wrong tries. Okay. Well, uh, I guess this is another quick pause while I find the real code, so I'll be back in a second. The powerful quad quark drives Rev to life. Time and space bend under the fibrillations of the time rip transfluxers. Your adrenaline and stomach reel with the hyperbolic hyperbole. And finally, finally, why nothing much happens. That must not have been a valid code. Try again. Okay. Why is that? That's what he did and it worked. Huh. Hello, Internet, and welcome back to Space Quest. Uh, is this the... Okay, this looks good, yes. Wait, is that what I typed oh, I in? Oh, I can, okay. Hold on. So let's... Uh, hello, I'm here. back again, I guess. I'm What's watching my old video to do? see what the code was. Will. Okay, let's see if I can hand this and that'll do it. Yeah, that's what you gotta do. You gotta hand them. See, this fits, because it's future, past, we're just going back in the past to look at the future. <coughs> That's fun. Yeah, yeah. What's in the, okay, what's in the box? The right it is a different, look at that. Huh. Okay. I was curious. So it seemed like I had a different code than the internet walkthroughs had. I think each playthrough maybe has a different code. Like it's randomly set, or maybe there's a random list. Okay, okay. So, uh, I'm going to take a photograph again. Photo. And now, uh, let's just, well, I'll just cut back into the normal video. Okay, so, it wasn't the other thing. We've got Funny H... T, E that's been shot, C, where are you, C, there you are, uh, another E that's been shot, and an A. Ah, tricky, tricky. So you do have to actually remember your code. The powerful quad quark drives Rev to life. Huh. Time and space bend under well, the fibrillations good to of the know. time rip Let's hope this one works. Your okay. adrenaline and stomach reel with yeah. the hyperbolic hyperbole. Yeah. And finally. Yeah. Finally. Ha ha! We've done it. To the future we go. Oh, different colors this time. That's neat. Yellow, orange, and magenta this time. Ah. Wow, that was a pain. <laughs> uh. Okay, hope no one's here to greet me. Nope, nope, don't touch. There we go. Okay. We look good. Do a quick savorino. Uh, yes. Right. Now, those guys were at this thing. This is the SQL Police Dispatch Monitor. At the moment, nothing okay. is being displayed. Can I fiddle? Oh, I can. Let's start a fiddling. Maybe I can you mess up where they are. You are unable to do anything with that now. 
Never mind. All right. Oh, this way we go. So, this sort of hover ship was here. Oh, right, there we go. Yeah, with the goofy face. Uh, what was on... I feel like there was a door on the other side. Did I go over there? I think I did. Let's go poke our heads in there and see if there's anyone around. Oh, come on. Yeah, this big Star Wars-y looking door. Your innate Hello. sense of curiosity makes you wish you knew the way to open this thing. Ah, well, I bet a hand would do the trick. That's how doors are opened most traditionally. None of the codes you punch in seem to have any effect on the door. Well, crap. Okay. Can I look at it now that I'm closer? Your innate sense of curiosity. No. What's it smell like? It's probably the most nauseating thing to smell in the whole family of smells. Ow. Oh. Harsh bud on the door. It needs salt. Oh. All right. Good to know. Uh. Maybe I yell at there it. There is no reply. No. Maybe I walk away. Maybe it just, it's sensing my desire. Hmm. Okay. What do I have on me? I have an ATM card. I have a cigar. I have the computer. Do I use, oh! I have this jar of mysterious acid. That's right, I was told to get that. Uh, I wonder. Yes, grip the asset. That. Okay. Select it. Yes. Can I... Is acid the key to doors? Now... Oh, yeah. Well, there's not much left of the lock now. That's good. Now, it is an electric lock, so... Generally, that would be... Mean it's now sealed forever. Ah, uh, not in this case, though. Just needing a firm kick. Okay. Should I be in here? I guess I should. I mean, I don't see why not. Oh. Mysterious. This long tunnel contains three circular steel portals, each containing nozzle-like projections. Yeah. Those are interesting. What's this terminal? Oh. Alright. I don't know what that is. Uh... You know... When I'm baffled... After a long day... I find... Smoking a cigar that my boss threw at me. When he fired me. You slide the conveniently pre-moistened stogie between your yeah. lips, apply a lit match, and proceed to nearly Helps hack up think. a lung. That's good. You ah. cast the old stogie to the ground. <laughs> okay. Uh, that's not a... Uh, PSA time smoking is not the answer unless it's specifically to reveal laser walls. So if you think there's a laser wall in front of you, light up a cigarette. Otherwise, don't because it's bad for your health. Uh, okay, I don't need these anymore. Uh, now that's lovely and all, but I don't think I could juke my way through them. I guess I could try. Uh, okay. Go for it, Roger. Nope. He, he didn't juke. We're glad you could play Space Quest for- Yeah, yeah, yeah. Real pant load. Okay. Well. So I've got this terminal. What does it do? 
Hmm. Here, I've got an idea. I don't know if this will work, but let's take our lightsaber. Nothing happens. Dang it. Can I use the book an again? SQ4 hint book. Maybe if I... Yes, there we go. Okay. I'm curious if one of the hints in here is about lasers. Uh, so... The tentacle wound, that's fine. Uh, can't seem to find the one-armed man. Can't hear what the two guys at the bar are saying. Uh, strawberry is sky, no. I'm in the stupid time pod, where else can I go? Yep. Oh, what was that question? Uh, when I try to splice the Vigilant cable to the Vigilant hollow mat. Uh, okay, I've not seen any of that yet. Uh, there's a large slimy creature blocking the door to the custodian's room in the Magmathian building. It's not even a question. You're right. That's just a statement. Okay, how do I get past the ah, how do I get past the large slimy creature? Uh, how do I do that? What what do you think he's waiting for? Waiting for a it custodian. Would serve no purpose. I missed the thing. I wonder if this is gonna happen. Uh Okay, I've got a book on rub running the suborbital Surrey. Maybe that's survey. What do I do with it? Did you enjoy? Why or why not? Explain your answer. Uh, I'm in a strange room inside the supercomputer. Scary eyeball looking things stare at me. Biomechanical bones liven up the area nicely. How do I get the door open? Doesn't sound quite right. I've fallen and I can't get up. We'll call your family in the hospital right away, Miss Fletcher. Well, that's good. Thank you. I've just started the game, and I've got the ample of... The water chewing the back. Okay, I don't know what that means. Uh, I installed the game as per instructions, and the game freezes up. Uh, is there a fix available for this? I walk into the first room and get the message, Oops, you tried something we didn't think of. My computer has a 5.25 drive. Okay. Uh, we're getting into the real... Oh, and I'm out of pages, it looks like. Okay. Well. I was hoping there'd be some info for these codes in there. Maybe it's like, uh... Like you've got to estimate to set them to degrees. Like this rotate... Because they look like they're on rotating rings. What if I type in 90... And then, like, I don't know, maybe like 2.30? Oh! Yeah, look at that, it did rotate. Ha-ha! Okay. This third one is... Uh, let's try going, like, 150. Oh, no, this one's the... I see, I see, I see. Okay, well, that looks pretty lined up. So the first one is this one. I assume it rotates this away. So let's try, like, 150 on it. Okay. Let's knock this one out 20. Never mind, it didn't move. Uh, and... Two. Okay, that didn't work. Right. So let's do... Okay, 33. Doesn't always seem to move. Maybe 50? No. None. 100. Does it over. Right. It seems to not like it when I only put in two digits. Oh, maybe I just have to type in zero to zero. Nope. Okay. Huh. So I want it to go like 170. That's close. Next one. This is really hard to visualize in the weird isometric deal. Uh, that one I think is done. 
let's do this one to go... Hmm. What do I think that would be? So 100, I need to go over 180. Let's go 220. That's not... Maybe these aren't... Maybe these aren't degrees? God, I don't remember radians. Uh, go east. Type in east. Okay. Huh. How to... How to get that to where I want it. So it seems to, if I type in like, what does this do? Nothing. Okay, well let's test it with here. So if I type in 180, it seems to go 90. Yeah, that's not 180. Interesting, interesting, interesting. What if I type in 090? Okay, it does a little bit. Weird. Okay, but I can sort of iterate it to do what I need it to do. Okay, that's gone too far. Okay, let's try O two O. Yeah, just a little twitch. Oh, crap. Now, maybe O two O again? No. Okay, there it goes. Huh. That's we I don't know quite why it doesn't work every time or what this what the input to rotation metric is, but that seems to be doing it. Now it looks like because these two are too vertical. Let's try just knocking this one up. Ten degrees. Twenty degrees. Huh! Well, I don't know how that worked, but we did it. And I didn't even have to look it up. That's fun. Okay. Now I'm going to save again. Uh, let's see. Out of the frying pan. That seems aptly named. So, Roger. I need you. Dead center. Good. Now. Keep your arms close to your body. Don't sway too much. I need you to go dead center over here. Okay. One done. Two cleared. Can he make it for a third? He can, ladies and gentlemen. We have done it. Now, what the heck is next? Oh. Mmm. It's pleasantly organic. Right. What is this lovely this maze thing? This of cables, ducts, pipes, and glowing panels gives the super brain computer a sense of being alive. Ah, it is a computer. You hear an electronic hum approaching from your left. Uh-oh. Well, I don't want that. Uh, walk this way, Roger. Back in the tube. I assume that's some sort of... One of those drone thingies. Okay, hopefully it's passed. You hear an electronic hum it's not. approaching from your left. Uh, maybe I have to hide under... Uh-oh. Ooh, mama. Okay, it doesn't now like us. you knew he was coming, didn't you? 
Oh, yeah, I didn't quite know what to do about him. Right. Okay. So, let's yes, align yourself. Target locked. Maybe if I just start moving, maybe I can outrun it. And it's just a case of don't go down the way it's coming, because it said from the left. So if I just book it straight, let's see what happens. So I assume there's a panel you hear down an there. an electronic hum approaching oh, from your yeah. left. That's fine. Yeah, I bet I need to do something with those panels. Ooh. This is lovely. What this are you? This maze of cables, ducts, pipes, and glowing panels gives the super brain computer a sense uh -huh. of being alive. Just more this super brain. No, no, no. We don't need that. You hear an electronic hum yep. approaching from your left. Le no, no, no. That's incorrect. It should be down. Okay, we'll go back. Maybe now I've juked... Okay, now never you mind. you knew he was coming, didn't you? Well, not really. Right. Can I, do I have to adjust course? I do not. He's smart enough not to walk through lasers. Hmm. Okay. What if I just charge it headlong? That could be something. Or maybe hit this. Oh, maybe these panels like put up a Don't wall. Don't mess with it. Uh, I'd love you to. You can't do that. Okay. Let's eyeball the panel real quick. Press you the button. Do that. What? You can't do that. Okay. It's got two C's. Ow. Now you knew he was coming, didn't you? Yeah. Uh, hmm. Okay, let's try one more time. I have a funny feeling. So, I know that somewhere I need to get a panel, or I need to get a thingy so that I can plug my computer into some terminals. I'm wondering if those are the terminals. Let's see if I can go forward there and see anything before the thing zaps me. You hear an electric. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's fine. Okay, so it's. There's not much I can do about that. You hear an electronic hum. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ah, uh, yeah. Now you okay, so it's just kind of on a coming, patrol. Didn't you? Yes. Hmm. That's tricky. Let me just observe real quick. Ah, uh... Uh, yeah. Okay. So that connector is the thing I need. That is the terminal. So, shockingly, instead of going forward, our solution is to go back. Now, I remember it was two C's. Kind of reversed on each other. What is that noise? Maybe that's just the noise this place makes. It's like a weird goopy diddly noise. Hmm. Yeah, so we'll head back over here. And I think by the look of things, next episode, we will go get that connector and see what we can do with those terminals. Hopefully it'll, like, close a bridge or put up a wall or something. Ah, uh, we'll hop in here to end it. But, I don't know. It's progress at least. So, yeah. Next episode may be the finale. May not. I don't quite know how much more is left in this, but... 
feels like we're getting somewhere. So, yeah, thank you, everybody, so much for watching. Feel free to check out everything else I've done. And until next week, bye-bye.